I'm working on a big project with that wonderful, iconic star, Divine. Oh, yes, yeah. Oh, right. yeah. 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 So there's a big stage show that's been written for me by a wonderful man called Ed Penny. So I could be doing a new stage show Ooh. on Divine. There's a touch of hairspray in the air. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh, the whiff of it makes He's me all over <laughs> hairspray. thrilled. And... Uh, a new project, Dance for Your Life for Alzheimer's and Dementia, which is my charity. Wonderful. Uh -huh. so oh, that's nice. Taking Strictly back. I think it for a good reason. Oh, good for and you. is that something that, that sort of fell in your lap, or are these things that you sort of, as, as I was saying, you sort of, it's, sometimes it can take a year. You set a plan or a resolution, and it's all just coming to fruition now? Well, I trained as an actor, mm. and when I did Strictly, yeah. I came out of Strictly, and on Boxing Day, that same year as Strictly, I got asked by Bill Kenwright and Andrew Lloyd Webber to take over from Michael Crawford in The Wizard of Oz. Mm. Mm. So, um, one thing led to yeah. another, it's been one showbiz... <sighs> what can I say? Showbiz thrill! Yeah, after another. <laughs> showbiz time, orgy. So, it is a showbiz, showbiz orgy. orgy. And every time <laughs> someone rings me up <laughs> and says, do you want to do this? And I go, just Go yes. on, then. We yes. not even told yeah. you what yes. yet. They go, I'll yes. do it, I'll do it. No, I said, we can't have you on without talking through, obviously, what's in, what's in store for the year ahead. So do you think you could give us a, a little rundown, starting with... What was the first one? Well, Aries, Aries is our first Aries. sign of the Zodiac. OK. I'm just going to give you one-liners, because okay. otherwise we could be here all day. OK. Yeah. Okay. I know you'd find that thrilling. Yeah, yeah. And so would everybody yeah. else. But I'll just give you... <laughs> because you want to hear about yourselves. But here we go. OK. Aries. For Aries, 2019 has all the makings of one of your luckiest years. Ooh. A dynamic international and intellectual drive is destined to take over. Okay. And that's all because of Jupiter. Now, Taurus, that's you, Jan. That's me. Last year was the start of a seven-year itch. Ooh. A desire for change, whether it's your image, or whether it's your life, your career, the things that you want to do. This promises Husband. to be... Husband? Yeah. <laughs> is he worried? What <laughs> sign is he in, I'll tell you. Capricorn. He should be worried. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. He's got other fish to fry. He's got... We'll get to Capricorn. Yes, OK, get to Capricorn. Anyway, yeah. so Taurus, uh, this promises to be an exceptional year for dramatic change. Initially for April Taurians, however, all of you Taurians will start to feel the vibe Ooh. of I want to do something mm, with okay. my life that's different to what I've been doing. OK. Right? Mm. Gemini, if you're dreaming of someone special to come into your life, then this could be the year you can burst with happiness, love and laughter. Oh. Brilliant. A few Geminis up there. Cancer. <laughs> Three eclipses starting in January and ending around your birthday, which is the June-July period, gives you the confidence to throw out the old and welcome in the new. Cancerians have a problem of letting things go, but this is year, <laughs> the year, to let it go. Let it go. Be like Frozen. Yeah. Always said Frozen. so. That's yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> Leo, the eclipse full moon on January the 21st gives you the impetus to eclipse your past and open a new window on your life. Pursue new creative projects or anything that you feel passionate Ooh, about. I don't know I anyone think. who's Leo or any of those. Can you oh. get onto one that I know? Oh, Megan, <laughs> Megan, Markle is, like me. Megan Markle is... Like me. Megan Markle is... Uh, <laughs> Megan Markle is really? Leo. Yes. You're having a baby, so that's a whole... Also, you've done yours. just committed a huge faux pas, Gary's Virgo, not Capricorn. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> Well, in that case, <laughs> you rest your case. Well, here comes Virgo. Yeah, Virgo. Come March, an uplifting and supportive connection between Saturn and Uranus. Create an affinity with your sun sign, giving you the impulse to carve out a fresh path for your life and living. Oh. So you're both on that vine. Hopefully Ooh. together. Oh, hopefully yeah. together. Yeah. Well, he's yeah. yeah. for learning Italian, isn't he? Yeah. Oh, That's yeah. another story. <laughs> yes. Well, I think it's all good. Do carry on. He yeah. may prefer to be a Capricorn come tomorrow. <laughs> um, anyway, Libra. That's me. That's, that's me. You, Andrea. Please say nice things. There's a lot going on at the start of the year and mid-year, giving you Librans the motivation to make changes <gasps> wherever you work or live. Oh, crikey! If you want a career to blow your mind. 
or move to a place that broadens your world. This is not a year to let the grass grow neath your feet. Ooh, so oh, so take a chance if it arises. Take That's a chance. Sort of thing. <gasps> take a chance. Take a chance. Take a chance. Oh, how exciting. So Scott. is there something that you you know the secret you wouldn't tell us before about your plan? About my plan could be. Is that got something to do with that? Yeah, all I'm gonna say is uh -uh. <laughs> wow. That's not technically saying, that's just making a noise. That anyway, sounded yeah. like family Karen. fortunes going wrong, didn't <laughs> yeah. it? Scorpio, oh. Nadia, darling. In the lyrics of ABBA, you've said take a chance. Oh, we're on, we're into an ABBA mood yeah. now. Money, money, money. Oh. Scorpio, money, money, money. Oh. But much depends on what you did last year so that you reap a golden harvest this oh, great. year. Oh, great. Dear, I spent it all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Invest in yourself, <laughs> your potential and your talents. Oh. And you will reap dividends. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you are my sign of the year. Oh. oh. With your own ruling planet Jupiter in your sign for this whole year, this is a year when you really can do no wrong. Your destiny calls you. Let the adventure Ooh. within you come out. Crikey. Can I change and be Sagittarius? <laughs> <laughs> well, her husband's her changed. Husband. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's all change. Let's all change. <laughs> uh, Capricorn, a year with everlasting consequences. A cute combination of innovation and caution helps you lay new, fresh life foundations. So this is your epiphany on January the 6th, when the first of a trio of life-changing eclipses. Eclipses get rid of the past and welcome in a new future. A big, big time for you, Capricorn. That's Mark, that's my other half. Is it? Yeah. And what does this mean? I don't know, you tell me. I'm about to, <laughs> because on. you're next, Aquarius. I'm next. With both your ruling planets in good vibration from oh. one another, from March, this is a year when common sense rides high, but it's a year to take a chance again. <gasps> oh. Do something you've always wanted to do. Oh, my God, I'm going to be in that rap video! Yeah! 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 It's time to... Follow your secret heart and pursue your desires. Oh, oh. well, I can't imagine what that means. Well, <laughs> mine is divine. Yeah. I love divine. Well, it's like as well, man. isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This Aquarius. is the year to do it, Aquarius. Oh, and finally, God. Pisces. Don't take on too much, Pisces. Your planets demand you're aware of the reality and the situation and don't get too carried away. But oh. romantic ripples... Embrace your mind, body, and spirit, which can work wonders for your heart or a vocation. Follow your fantasies, but remember, the other man's grass isn't always green. Mm. What do you know, going to say then? That is such Petula a cool thing, romantic Petula. fantasy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that, Russell, that's Carol. Russell, nobody does it like you do. Thank yeah. you so much nobody for having me.